Hey everyone, we're here with tonight's item shop video. And it looks like we got the, um, what do you call them? The chapter relevant skins. Like, you know, they symbolize each of the chapters. I do like the holographic back bling. So as you could see, as I scroll through, it's, it represents the different chapter one seasons. So I guess it makes sense for this to return this season, especially. So definitely a lot of great selections. It's good for memory wise, like if you wanna always remember this stuff. So pretty nice. And then you got the skins themselves, which I do like this one, this chick, because uh, reminds you of Lux. That was that battle pass skin. But um, yeah, each of their styles, you can look over it, it tells you the exact season it's from of chapter one and it basically matches the color scheme or the theme of that season. So, not bad at all. Definitely a good idea if you wanted to get these skins. So, you got the male and the females. And then you got, in the Fortnite favorites again, you got Pepper Thorn. She's got her style. You could take off the hat, you could take off the glasses. And have it like that if you want it. And then she got the hard case hero back bling. Uh, no, edit style just adds more stickers and badges to her back bling. Dance therapy. So pretty cool. I don't know if it's rare. I feel like I haven't seen that one in a while though. Got that back. The bright storm bomber with the dark version. Same thing with Gordo here. And same thing as well with the Breezy Bashers. So, definitely if you if you didn't buy either Bright Bomber or Dark Bomber and you just feel like you want a much more casual skin, nothing too flashy, then you could probably just do this one. And then off to here, this row we got the Galaxy Grappler Bundle. So, pretty nice. Honestly, I don't hate it. We got the Hands of the Galaxy Reactive Back Bling and Reactive Eliminations. The Galaxy Star Blade Pickaxes. The Vortexual Animated Gun Wrap. We got Guff off to the side here as a standalone with the Fluffle Bag Back Bling. Definitely a fun skin to have. Bust a move. And then phone it in. So definitely a good night for emotes, I'll tell you that. Oh wow, we got a lot of rows today. We have Oblivion. Back from season four, it looks like. I can only assume this is the female version to that Omega skin that came out in the Battle Pass. Then we got the Destabilizer. Same kind of all gold style as a skin. We have the Garrison skin. I don't think this one's too rare. I feel like it came back a couple times. But you guys are better judges than me. We have the Bandolette with this awesome little rainbow style. The Bandolier, which I'm pretty sure also has that style. Yeah, but not as not as cool as the female. And you got the Armory Bag Back Bling with the edit style as well. We got the Machete Pickaxe. Honestly, a pretty great one. Digital Grayscale Gun Wrap. The Chopper Glider. The Unreal Chill music pack. So, pretty cool, pretty calm music. It's something to play in the background for sure. I have the Singing Siren Bundle with Serenade here. Definitely a top tier skin. I'd recommend it. With the Fluttering Notes back bling, the Sea Bound Slasher pickaxe, that Overflow Gun Wrap, which is reactive. The Serenade Song. Which, you know, I won't play a lot at, mostly because you guys probably can't hear it. And then, let's see if we don't, don't screw this up this time. Full screen of the loading screen. So, pretty great. You got levels, you got the crew. Oh, wow. Okay, I heard this pack was returning. I didn't know tonight was going to be the night, but alright. So, definitely a night for this pack. You got Philip J. Fry with the Hypnotoad back bling. Taranga Leela, Nibbler back bling. Bender Bending Rodriguez with the Ben Rodriguez back bling, which is reactive. 
And then you got the gear bundle, giant nutcracker, the solid gold fiddle, the unbendable girder, Zoidberg scuttle, which is traversal, and the Planet Express ship. So this is the second time that this has come to the item shop. I don't remember, I think I I this stayed in for a couple days when it came out. So it's not all that rare, but I'm, I do hope they still make more of these skins because I love this show. But um, other than that, that's pretty much it for the item shop. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I shall see you guys in my next one.